Hello and welcome back to Final Fantasy, where we definitely know what we're doing. Uh, speak for yourself, Jacob. I... It's clearly Dr. P is conscious, but, uh, go down. Go down. Go down. Go, go back in, go back into the city. Oh, God. Go down. Oh, God. Oh, no, go up. We okay. Got, we gotta go up. Keep going up. Keep okay. going up. Yep. Get to the right. To the right? That's the church. But they won't let me in. She gets oh. to move. And this is where we heal? Yeah. Then we'll have to stay at the inn again. Okay. Oh, it's gonna cost us money. <laughs> Why do we have to stay at the inn after we heal up? I don't think it heals us all the way. It might. I don't know. Oh, Dr. The... P! So the inn heals us, but the church resurrects... 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 Resurrect... Wow, I can't say that. <clears throat> resurrects us. Yeah. It's, that one. It's a difficult word to say. It's a, it's especially in standard American. Yeah. Standard American. Standard American English. Standard American. Uh, <clears throat> Would you like to resurrect Barto? Ah, Barto. God. Arise, fallen warrior. Barto is like the friend that you have to apologize for. That's why he's the white mage. <laughs> Nobody cares about Barto. Oh man. So, do you know anything about like white mage jokes? No. White mages are always thrown under the bus so it's really funny that you just like feel that way about really? Bardo based off of his name i don't even know what the hell white mages do they, they just heal they're just oh, good really? for healing oh that sounds like it's a vital part they're, yeah well it is but like they're not good in attacking so they're always thrown under the bus as being like oh they're the weak guys oh they're the support i see not the heavy heaters mm -hmm. they're no pizzicuca or dr p i like to call him pixie for short okay you go with that Oh, and they fist pump. That's how happy they are about being full health. Yeah, they're super ready to go, just like we are. Except for actually, you know what we should do, Jacob? Buy some weaponry? Yeah, because we learned that over the, to the left. But to the left? I thought those were the spells. See, that's a sword? Oh, yeah. That's where the weapons are. <laughs> but all he has is blue. If you go to buy. <gasps> what? Yeah. All oh, right. You can buy a rapier for. We could also give him warning. a nunchuck. I don't know who that's for. The it knife, says it's not the good. Staff. The staff is better for some people. The rapier is really good for both. Um, we should get the rapier to Doctor P. Yeah, and then get and the, the hammer for uh, Pixie. And then get the staff for the white mage, or no wait for the black mage. Yeah, wait. Yeah, staff for the black mage. So. Rapier first. And Bardo doesn't need anything. Bardo's got cure. He'll be fine. <laughs> because fuck Bardo. Okay, buy that. Okay. Do I give it to him? Like, we how have, did it... Yeah, okay, buy a hammer. Thank you. And, and then... staff. Yeah. Okay, exit. And, and how then, do I equip So them? when you go, press start. Then go to uh, equipment. And then whoever you want to equip things to. And equip optimal can will automatically do it if you click equip you can choose and select so you go to weapon you give ah. him a rapier. yeah boom okay. bam done yay all right no save yeah let's save here I right, would do that on accident but hey never a bad time true what fine save now I want to go you back have, to the you equipping. Have to press B. There we go. Yeah. B. No. <laughs> okay. And now I want <laughs> equipment. Jacob's learning. It's. It's finicky. I know. Oh God. Equip. You uh, want to, what do you hammer, want to give him? Right. Yeah. yeah. And then. B. B. And then A. Oh my God. Okay, I got it. <laughs> Figuring it out. Yay. It's. This is not. Th this interface is just not built for Jacobs. I agree. If you yeah. haven't guessed already, I'm in the pilot seat. Go the to the left. Chair. Wait, go back up. What else could be here? We have to buy some armor. Oh my god. So that things don't kill us in one hit like why, we learned. Why do we need so much shit? Leather armor. Leather. Why is leather armor better than... Oh. Oh, there's... never mind. We should just get chain mail. Yeah. One chain mail and one leather armor. Chain mail. No, not another. Leather armor for Dr. P. Yeah, and they can't wear anything else because they're dumb mages who can't wear clothes. Equipment. You are going to wear some clothes. Thank you. And you are also going to wear some clothes. 
cover yourself. I demand some perfect modesty from you, yeah. Pixie and Dr. P. Now we're ready to go. I come from a land where modesty is um, <clears throat> a very important part of our society. Yeah. Uh, because, I, I don't know if you know this, but in Final Fantasy Land, yeah. they're all prudes. Oh, jeez. And even the wolves are pr prudes? Yes. Prudes? Um, so can I, should I magic them? Uh, if, if, are you, who are you using, Dr. P? I'm using the black mage. Little blue guy? Yeah. Bar Use magic? Use thunder. thunder. We don't have any items to heal our magic, so we have to go to the, oh, he missed. Oh, wow, that hammer looks cool. Oh, oh shit! That's so cool! <laughs> They're so happy about the fact that they just killed wild animals for no good reason. They are the heroes? How dare you offend them? <laughs> They're the warriors of light. I feel like the warriors of light should still be held to a certain standard. I mean... Sure. <laughs> oh, wow. We didn't even need... We didn't even need to get to the thunder. Yeah. We're already kicking ass. Yeah, we are. And perhaps even taking a name or two. Yeah, how many names? Um, one. Frank. Oh! We got to get rid of those guys first. The hard, tough guys. The purple ones. Wait. Magic. Yeah. Yeah. Boom. Yeah. Oh. Damn. All right. Oh. Even White Mage is doing good. That's because Bardo feels we need to We probably don't need to use himself. Thunder anymore on these, like, green guys. I think... I think Malcolm can take him on. Okay. With the uh, staff. Is Thunder, like, run out? Like, can we run out of Thunder? Yeah, so you have an MP gauge. Yeah? Where's so that? on the right, where, where, where it says 11. Yeah. That it keeps going down every time we use it. It costs, I think, three to use every time. And we have to buy something to increase it? Yeah, we have to buy ethers, or we have to go sleep at an inn. Okay. God, that chainmail makes it so he only takes one damage from that guy. Yeah. Dude, we're so ready for this. So, Kane. Uh-huh. Tell me about your favorite experience at a hotel. Uh. Mostly because you just said the word inn. Oh, and okay. I feel like hotels are important for Well, there was childhood. this one time, I was hanging out with my friends, mm -hmm. and we went to Seaside um, in Oregon. Yeah. Where's Seaside? It's to the left. Oh, you mean like literally the side that's by the sea? Yes. Oh, I thought like Seaside was the name of a hotel. Well, no, it's the name of the park. town. Oh, really? Yeah, but it is by the sea. It's a beach town. I feel like I could come up with a name slightly more creative than that very quickly. I feel like you're probably right. But then again, I also created the name Pixel Club. <laughs> so who, who am I to judge? Exactly, but Pixie is one of the most beloved characters on the show. Yeah? Yeah. Look how he hits those goblins. He hits them so hard. Hits them hard, hits them fast. Yeah. Hits them high, hits them low. Anyway, we went to the seaside, and um, we stayed at a hotel, me and like four of my friends. But yeah. I had to buy a separate room in the hotel, because uh -huh. apparently only four people can stay in like a, a single bedroom with two beds. Yeah. Because only, there are only two be people can sleep in one bed. Oh, okay. By state law or whatever. Mm-hmm. And so I bought my... By state law? Just making sure no one gets too frisky out there. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So I ended up... Whoa, these are skeletons. They're skeletons that are going down pretty fast. They're using their arms as swords. I love skeletons that use bone weaponry. Yeah. Because it feels weird. <laughs> yeah. It's like, what if you ripped out your own arm and yeah, used <laughs> it to kill people? <laughs> what if I had a flesh weapon? Ew. Exactly. Like, what if you came across a giant spider yeah. that used tiny spiders as weaponry? <laughs> like tiny spider nunchucks. And they're connected by webbing and it yeah. just whips it around. I'd be terrified because that's spooky. But to finish my story, yes. I slept in a separate room than all my friends. And I watched uh, that one Matt Damon movie where he has a zoo. <laughs> Oh, the one where he buys a zoo? Yeah, and has a zoo. Yes. I watched five, fifteen, the last 15 minutes of that movie. Did he like, successfully buy the zoo? He successfully kept the zoo from the bad guy who ah. was the health inspector. 
Okay. And that was the best experience I've had in a hotel. Well, on that note, I'll see you guys next episode. <laughs>